Understanding football playstyles, part two, Tiki Taka. Tiki Taka is a possession heavy playstyle that is based on passing, patience, movement, and fluid player positioning. The most notable teams to have played a Tiki Taka style of football are Pep Guardiola's Bayern Munich and Barcelona teams, alongside with the Spanish national side of 2008 to 2012, managed by Vicente Del Bosque. Tiki Taka was developed from the total Dutch football implemented into Barcelona by the late Rinus Mikuls and further by Johan Cruyff and eventually passed down to the likes of LVG, Frank Rankard and now Ronald Koeman. One of the main misconceptions about Tiki Taka is that it's just solely based on quick passing and nothing else. This isn't the case. Iniesta would often say his job at Barcelona was to pass, move, offer, receive, which simply up Tiki Taka in a very very simple phrase. It was all about giving the ball, offering for the ball and using positional play to take advantage of space of the opponent. Ah, tiki Taka, that's something like this. So he puts the ball but, but as, as quick as possible and these sort of things but it's, it's when we started in Barcelona to do positioning play. It's responsibility of the ball, where you play, how you play. Controlling the ball is the basis of football. In the beginning that was uh, something to, uh, where people laughed about because they didn't understand that it was football and uh, until it had a result and people enjoyed it and people loved it and now it's a fantastic work. One of the reasons why Tiki Taka works so much under Pep Coleman and Louis van Gaal is because it's blended with total football and total football encourages the exploitation of space and fluid position in the final third therefore becoming much more creative in the last phase of the game using positional plays like the false nine to draw out centre-backs and open up gaps between the centre-halves. Using roaming playmakers and inverted wing-backs is another sign of this encouragement of exploiting space. However, Tiki Taka could be seen as the hardest way to play football, as it takes the most technical and mental ability to play. To pass off a receive pass for 90 minutes straight can be mentally exhausting, and therefore implementing it into 11 players takes an unbelievable level of coaching and personnel on the pitch. You look at one of the best trios in world football ever to exist, Xavi, Iniesta and Lionel Messi. There's nothing great physically about them, but technically and mentally in terms of football, they are unmatched in what they do. However, without the right personnel on the pitch, Tiki Taka can become quite stale and quite boring. And we've seen many examples of this over the past few years. Louis van Gaal with Manchester United, Ronald Koeman with Everton, even Frank de Boer with Crystal Palace. And this is why it's viewed as one of the hardest ways to play football, because it takes the very best players in each position. I'm sorry that this episode of Understanding Football was a bit too long, but I'm really passionate about Tiki Taka and Total Football, so I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did making it. And let me know which one you want to see next. Thank you.